Cape Canaveral because this is Boeing Starliner mission. Uh, it's uh, just under a minute from liftoff. It's its third attempt at launching a first crewed test flight. Uh, it's been about a decade in the making. Uh, this is a new spacecraft. It's a maiden voyage. It's got humans on board uh, on track uh, to lift off from Cape Canaveral in Florida. Uh, there we go. Uh, the liftoff has begun. So that, the mission known as the Crew Flight Test, is the culmination, they say, of Boeing's efforts to develop a spacecraft that would rival SpaceX's uh, crewed Dragon capsule. Uh, we've seen a lot of SpaceX launches, that normally just to launch mini satellites from Starlink service. This, though, uh, a crewed flight test. Uh, fairing astronauts, one uh, assumes ultimately to things like the space station under NASA's commercial crew program. Now remember a lot of this is about moving space exploration, space development away from the public sector and things like NASA towards the private sector and having private sector involvement, investment and money in it. Um, now it looks to me, I mean, I'm no space expert, it looked pretty successful so far. Uh, if it is ultimately successful, it marks the only, uh, only the sixth inaugural journey of a crewed spacecraft in US history. Uh, so this, the rather incredible image that we're getting now, from uh, what is Boeing's Starliner mission. Uh, this is the third attempt to launch its first crewed flight test uh, more than a decade in the making. I could watch his pictures all day. Uh, we'll keep a close eye on how that goes, but uh, that, the moment of liftoff there from Cape Canaveral in Florida.